welcome! In this guide, I'll show you where to find all of the zone lore for the Exile Starter Area, Northern Wilds. I'll be going in order of appearance from the start of the zone following the quest route. Follow along, or check out the description below to jump straight to the pieces you're missing. At the start of the zone, climb the left platform at the landing site to grab your deployment orders for Operation Snowfall. Explore the wreckage in the crash site to uncover Sadie and Deadeye's shuttle boarding pass. The violent Tempest Data Cube can be found in the ancient tower just behind the control panel. Head into Exolab 729 and check the data cube on the left to learn about the Primal Disruptor. There's a second data cube in the Exolab, but the door is locked. You'll need to find a scientist or be one yourself to get in. Once you do, you'll find the data cube for volatile power hovering in the center of the room. Collecting it will also grant you an achievement. There are four lore pieces to collect in Settler's Reach. On your left coming down from the tower, you'll first be directed to a data cube that will introduce you to the Nexus Project. Check out the book next to the Nexus Project data cube for a rundown on the Exile's not-so-secret secret ops. This book doesn't actually appear in your lore list for the zone, but since it's in the area, I'm including it anyway. The cot next to this campfire holds your first key to the Northern Wilds copy of Tales from Beyond the Fringe. Before you head out of Settler's Reach, read a copy of the Galactic Explorer's Handbook from the table to the right of the exit path. Keep an eye out for a Yeti cave just north of the trail between Settler's Reach and Coldboro Cavern. Inside, you'll discover Rinzo's journal. Head left as you enter Coldboro Cavern from the main trail and you can find the first volume of Lux Report. You may have to zap a few skeech before you can grab it. Volume 2 of the report can be found a little farther in and to the south next to a couple of Skeech huts, and some Skeech. Pick up Lust's final report by the cauldron just right of the Coldboro Cavern cave entrance. Head on inside the cave and drop to the lower level to be enlightened by a copy of beautiful Skeech poetry. The name Skeech Frosty spawns in this same area, so this is a good opportunity to bring him down if you haven't already.
At the very back of Coldborough Cavern, you'll find a data cube for decelerated gestation next to a named monster and a clutch of xenobite eggs. Finally, head to the end of the trail and Camp Ice Fury at the very end of the zone to pick up the second key for the Northern Wilds copy of Tales from Beyond the Fringe. Obtaining both keys will unlock the Exile version of the issue Adventure Awaits. That's the last one! Now you have a full list of Northern Wilds lore and where to find it. See you next time!